Why did you decide to, to be involved in the production of this movie? Uh, when we were finished reading the script, we were just all so moved by the story, and we just wanted to bring that kind of storytelling into the theaters. According to your experience, it's uh, easier to be a son or a father? Hmm. I don't know if either is easy. Mm -hmm. And I think um, the great thing about the judge is so many women see the movie and they go, the judge, that's my mom. <laughs> or, you know, my sister and I have this complicated relationship or stuff, so. I just think that, you know, there's always challenges to, uh, to uh, reconciliation with family. I was to be the son of Robert Duvall in the movie. <laughs> kind of great. I look over that poster and I just, you know, remember the, all these memories of, of shooting the film last year and now being here and being able to promote it is, is just great. Obviously, he's an extraordinary guy. Um, but he's also just, you know, he's a very kind of straightforward, he reminds me of, not actors, he reminds me of people that I knew growing up, like a school teacher or a counselor or a um, friends of my dad or, you know. Mm -hmm. uh, yesterday you, uh, you mentioned the, the myth of coming back at home. Uh, what, what's the meaning of, uh, for you to, to coming back to home? I think it's, it's about reflection mm -hmm. and particularly when you're not a kid anymore, you start having these memories that don't just go back a few years, they go back 10, 20, 30 years. Mm -hmm. And you attempt to kind of make sense of, of, a, of a life, you know? And it's always in the, in the context of other people, you know, your relations, your, um, your family. Um, the family rules, it's, uh, it's uh, an issue of the movie and uh, it's an issue also for Italian culture. <laughs> so uh, I want to ask you, uh, do you think it's possible to escape from family roots? Yeah, uh, I'm just imagining uh, roots that would be worth escaping from. But I think part of it is rather than escape it, can you try to transcend it and can you try to be of service to it, you know? Because um, ultimately we're supposed to try to help each other. You had uh, you had several lives in uh, in your career and maybe also in your personal life. Uh, what uh, helps you most to rebirth every time? Uh, I suppose it's being able to uh, start every day like it's the first day, mm -hmm. and also. Um, you know, just be in right relationship with the people you're dealing with, you know? I mean, you know, we're... I, I think just respecting the moment and whoever you find yourself in the company of is, is important. Mm -hmm. We are in Italy. I have to ask you about the Pinocchio yes. project. <laughs> uh, we're developing it. I think mm -hmm. it'll be great and we'll want to shoot as much of it in Italy as possible. But what, what do you like in Pinocchio? It's just one of the all-time great stories. It's like it's like it's it's Italy's Alice in Wonderland. It's this amazing tale, and it's a it's a global mm. myth, you know. Mm -hmm. How could you invite the Italian audience to see the judge? Well, I mean, you know, as folks go and see the movie, their the you know their their reaction has just been astounding and really great. And, um, you know, but it's always a market. It's like you have to get people to go there. You know, you can't, someone can't enjoy a movie they don't see. So, um, you know, just the, the endorsement of people who've already seen the movie is, is the best, is the best uh, test of things, you know. Okay. Thank you. Thank you.